everyone, this is Tony Shish's Tech. I'm Tony, and in this video, I'm gonna show you how to SSH into a remote computer from either your Mac or a Linux operating system. Now, in order to do this, we're just gonna be using Terminal Program, which is built into these operating systems. It's really easy. If that's something you wanna to learn to do, let's get on into the tutorial here. Okay, so this is the remote server that I wanna log into. It has this IP address. And all we have to do is open up Terminal. So I already have it opened here. Um, I actually have a link down here in my doc, but let me just show you. If you don't know how to use the Terminal or find it on your computer, you can just go to the Spotlight, type in Terminal, and that's what you're looking for. So that's what we're gonna use. The command that we're gonna execute is the SSH command. It's gonna be SSH space, the username, which you can see here is root. So I'm just gonna type root at the IP address. So like I said, this is the IP address. We'll go ahead and copy the IP address, come over here and paste it in and you can hit enter. Now, the first time you're connecting, you're gonna see this little warning and it's gonna say, are you sure you wanna to connect to it? Do you trust it? If you trust it, you can go ahead and type in yes, hit enter. And now it's asking you for the password. So for the password, you're gonna need the password. You should know that ahead of time. Um, I have my password over here. Uh, I can copy it or um, if I wanted to, I can start typing the password in, uh, but it's easier for me to just copy it, do the same type of thing that we did before, right click paste, and you won't see it appear for security reasons, but it's in there. All we have to do now is hit enter. Oops, but there we go. We are logged into the remote server. Um, as you can see, this is an Ubuntu server, so you know, we can, execute some basic commands like pwd for print working directory you can cd into the root of the whole system you can ls to list out the directory contents all that good stuff um, that's about it guys this is how you log into a remote server and i i think if there is any questions that you have about this topic please let me know in the comments below um, i am using volter to do this demonstration so or i guess it's pronounced vulture to do this demonstration so um i'll have some information on the screen in the links down below if you're interested in acquiring a remote server for whatever reason and yeah i think that's about it i guess one other thing is just to exit that's how you get out of it you can type exit or hit the x up here so we'll hit exit Hit enter. Now we're back on to our local computer. That's it. Thank you guys for watching. Have a great day. I'll see you in the next video.